Rainbow Tastic sitting in with me is Fretless Arcade. Sup, my nerds. We're gonna try to get through Between Me and the Night again, I think. What I did wrong and what may have been a problem last time why I couldn't progress is that maybe there is a certain order in which I need to do things. So I think this time we're gonna, probably gonna fast forward through a lot of the puzzle solving and only show when there's something new. Is that I think this time I, I am mostly just going to try on focus doing my chores. <laughs> and instead of playing with Jimmy, who is a cunt. <laughs> is this a kitchen? I don't remember. Yes. Yep. Hey guys! You gonna Breakfast ditch me time. again? It's okay, you had more important things to do anyway. Oh, but they left a note. Yeah, they're just telling me to do my chores. They took breakfast away, though. Yeah, like... I can't have breakfast? I was hungry. I wonder if I can just... Okay, yeah, I can just read it there. I think we can remember that. Cat gets breakfast. The cat gets breakfast. Where's my breakfast? <laughs> Stupid cat. I am so done with cats right now. I mean, cats just have the best life. I, I know, right? Like, I'm asleep for 30 minutes and then I hear their crap. Okay. Here you go, Fluffy. <laughs> Here's your food. Don't murder us. I'm gonna pitch it. Still messed up! We have domesticated. Okay, hey. so I know where everything is since, you know, I spent like two hours on this. Oh god, the sun's going down. Uh oh. Jimmy! Jimmy, don't start your shit! Jimmy! Oh, I hear him. Is that there being a cunt? Okay, I'm gonna go introduce vulgar yeah, to, to I have Jimmy. yet to meet Ah, oh, crap! Jimmy. I gotta censor out your name. Yeah. Uh, unless you care about that. I mean... Jamie? I just heard you, you cunt! That we know is here. Jimmy! He's just messing with your mind. Jimmy! Jimmy! See, you're so alone <laughs> in this game, even Jimmy doesn't want to play with you. That's how depressing this is. Screw you, I'm awesome! I'm gonna do this. Go for a little joyride? Oh, it's just a trunk. Gimme, give gimme give the things. Okay, thank you. Jimmy! It's night time, where are you? Are you up here? Jimmy doesn't want to come around and be depressed by our loneliness. Jimmy can go suck a big phone. Oh, there he is! Jimmy. Oh, hi, Jimmy! <laughs> I'm sorry I called you a cunt. I didn't mean it! I mean, I did! Because you're kind of a cunt. You see what happens when he catches you, Vogel? That. Ah. Uh, good times. See, even Jimmy gets breakfast. Screw you, Jimmy! Everybody gets breakfast but us. I'm really feeling unloved. I want some breakfast. Taco Bell breakfast. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that doesn't look good. Huh? That's my brother. Or that's that's his brother. Doesn't look like someone I want to play with right now. Okay. Going downstairs because I have to cut the grass. I'm going to eat, get eaten by the lawnmower. Because that's what happens when you cut grass alone. More. The lawnmower, it tries to eat you. Yeah. I've cut grass before. I've been eating a few times, but... Alright, you have to go down to the 
Whatever. Okay. Uh, Use the things on the thing. Oh, oh my god, <laughs> are you kidding me? Oh, are you kidding me? What the fuck? What the actual hell? Okay, so you carry those over. Whip into. Okay, so right there. there. You Yay! Alright. Okay. I need to get the gasoline from the garage. I'm gonna take that screwdriver with me. There's a lot of menial labor going on right now. Like, is this game just about chores? Is that what's so depressing about it? Mm, I don't think so. I think, like, maybe something messed up's happened with his family. I mean, and I maybe this that, is just how he's like up family. They yeah. just have him doing chores. Yeah. Well, I think like <laughs> I haven't seen the mom since breakfast and a couple of his memories, or in any of other things. So I think maybe the mom is is like missing or something. Yeah. Or you know maybe you know I know he's got I know he's doing a lot of chores, but maybe something really messed up has happened in his family, and this is just how he's dealing with it. Because like it Maybe seems like misses. it seems like um, he's fantasizing about being the knight in the game, and he's paying more attention to that than he is his actual life, which I can totally relate to. You don't know how many days of my childhood I spent imagining that I was Link from The Legend of Zelda. Yeah. Well, and it may be the type of thing too where he's missing his family being there to make him do chores. He misses that part of his normal life. Now that it is, it is obviously something is really messed up. I'm gonna go hang out on the stairs while I wait for Jimmy to come out and then go away and we're gonna talk. Cool. Which we're probably not going to show you guys, so uh, see you when the sun's back up. Later. Uh, Is it okay that I call you Yeah. Okay, so I'll <laughs> beat that out. I'll just make it look bad. Like I'm an ass or something. As far as my like, page and everything I, with my music and stuff, I go by both names. Okay, cool. <laughs> you have to have like a cool name too, like a DJ type name, you know. <laughs> DJ Fretless. Exactly. DJ Fretless. It's just it's not catchy enough. That's my real artist. I think it name. should be Go Voga Pogo. And then I have Fretless Arcade. <laughs> it is a catchy name because it's it's German, so it's like. Yeah. Well, especially in these parts. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> and yet nobody can say it right unless I pronounce it first. Really? Mm -mm. I went when I went to vote yesterday. Mm -hmm. They had to have me pronounce it. F. <laughs> yeah, I get f. <laughs> like <laughs> they make it a U. All kinds of stuff. See, so, yeah, I understand people <laughs> messing up. Your name, but how do you get Morgan out of Morgan? Magnum? I can understand even Magnum because there's a little dyslexia. In oh that, yeah, that, that's that's totally Morgan. normal, and I'm okay with Magnum, but Morgan, really? <laughs> <laughs> that I got a letter addresses that once, and I'm like, this doesn't even dignify a response. No. Uh, and don't get me started on. Where the hell does that P look like an A? Well, you know, we are from the South. Most people's grammar sucks. Yeah, not very true. I never understood what was so hard about reading, though. Like, oh, it's like uh, Janice. I mean... Her name was pronounced wrong by somebody every day. Hey, Jimmy. I wonder if he's doing chores, too. Maybe his chore from his parents. I is want to know us. what's up with Jimmy. I want to know, cause like mm. in the trailer, it's obvious that the thing chasing you is one of the teachers. That's grotesque and messed up. I want to know who that is. Yeah. Well, that's gonna be the big twist at the end. Bum bum bum. It's your mother. <laughs> oh man, what if it is? Ow. It's possible. Oh yeah, welcome back from that uh, break, guys. So anyway, Fretless Arcade is a friend of mine. He also does music, and his channel is featured on ours. So if you get a chance, go check out some of his music. He's actually going to do some stuff for us to use. Yep, and this I got is some him. Hot jams. Hey, 
dick holes, this is him giving us permission to use his music for our videos. I signed this with my voice. It is well, not like gasoline. Well, you know, whenever people start putting copyright strikes and uh, claims on videos of snow falling. Oh, yeah. Because really, uh, this is how you mow the lawn. Oh. oh. Uh oh. And there we go. Don't die. Oh. You're not even running at first, you're just like walking. I'm just gonna walk away from the deadly lawnmower. Like, you could at least sprint a little bit. Dad! The lawn is done. I broke the lawnmower! <laughs> I broke it! Oh, you're oh. fighting. Okay, oh. see, the last playthrough, that didn't happen. Oh, now they're... I could move them around, but they weren't stone. Now I'm supposed to... What now the, they're hugging it what out. What the mess. <laughs> well, I saw, like, I went back and watched the trailer and I saw them getting pushed together. So I'm gonna do that before I do anything else. <laughs> hug it out. Go hug your daddy. Go give him the love he needs. So now I need to find the claw cans. And I'm pretty sure I remember where they're at. I'm not positive. I know where one is because I saw it like 17 times before I realized it was there. <laughs> hidden in plain sight. Absolutely hidden. You want to know where it was? Where? Let me get there before you... Ooh! Whoa. It didn't happen last time either! Whoa. What the hell is that? Oh Wait god! The phone. Stop it! Is he eating the floor of the house? Whoa. He was calling. What happened? There. <laughs> I walked in and out of this room 14 times in the previous video before I realized like... it was ever there. Ooh. Oh god. It's his parents fighting. So, yeah, so I think something's really messed up with this family. Is that them yelling at each other, I think? I think so. They're either yelling at each other or they're yelling at him for breaking the vase. I haven't figured it's, it's out. It's the lawnmower. You broke the lawnmower. Oh yeah, time yeah, to I, DJ. I uh, remember where a lot of this stuff is, so... Jimmy's out there, I'm just gonna hang out here. This music is intense. It is. It's also, like, kind of hurting my ears a little bit. Like, I think I have an ear it's infection. It's, like, half ambient, partially atonal, just very... grotesque sound. Oh, I hear him. With just enough do, do, actual do, 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 music do, do, in there do, do, to give you a hint at it. Do, 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 do. Whoever did the sound design on this game did a wonderful job. Because the sound experience makes this game. Oh yeah, Vogel knows all about music. like So I'm really excited to use some of his stuff for the channel. While we wait for Jimmy to stop being a cunt. Yes. Guys... I really don't want to deal with Jimmy's crap today. Yeah, I gotta go to work later. I got enough to deal with. Don't need Jimmy. Oh, I just noticed that hole in the wall. Yeah. Uh, and there's Jimmy. It's good. I turned the lights on. What, um, uh, that buys me time and distracts him. Well, I do this. It's almost like you've played this before. Oh, I have played this before for like two hours. <laughs> for like two whole hours and didn't get anywhere. Oh, but that's the beautiful thing about trial and error. 
That's why I love games like this. I, I remember think playing games like this before the gone. internet where you actually had to try and use your brain and figure it out yourself. Right? I love games like this. I was looking forward to this game so much. I bought it before it was fully released. Didn't play it. I, I had other things going on. And here we are. And here we are. Like, oh. And it's just Wunderbar. Like, if I were a guy, I would have such a hard-on for this game. It wouldn't be funny. Well, I'm married, but it's a great game. Oh, yeah. Let's see. All right. Yeah, right click. Now we're talking. Oh, yeah. Vogue Paul and I start headbanging at the same time. Yeah, that is friendship. It's when you headbang to an awesome song together. Okay. So We can still hear it from the other room. Oh yeah, and so it's gone. now Aww. I know I can get into his room, but last time uh, when I was playing, there wasn't really a whole lot in his room that was important, other than a cassette that I don't know that I necessarily have to listen to. But what I do know is that he'll help me move this. Since I found his album for him, and we're friends now. And we have another shuriken disguised as a clock hand. Which means, and, I, and, I, and I'm pretty sure, I'm not 100% sure, but I'm pretty sure the whole point is to get into this room. Because I remember that's where the arcade is, and I'm, and I may be wrong, but I think that's how you progress, is to, is to go play on the arcade machine, or thingy, whatever. That's what happened so last think... time, but so far, a few things have happened before that didn't yeah. happen last time. I mean, there are plenty of reasons I'm playing this game and recording it. Yeah, sure, yeah, I have a YouTube channel. Also, anyone that's stuck like I was and may need a little help figuring things out can look back to this video as a reference and, and use it to progress in the game because people really should play games like this. It's, like, the best thing ever. Oh, it didn't work. Katie is over there jamming the music. No, that did not work. I need to push you closer together. Freaking table in the way. <laughs> Freaking table in the way. Oh. Oh, it did work. It out. Yes. Yes, I'm not going to yell too loud again because I feel like that made my name Ray very. Oh God, Jimmy's out. And yeah, here we are again. No, I can make it to the arcade machine. I, I can make it to the thingy. I can do the things. No, oh! Jimmy! Fuck you! <sighs> you didn't. You could not do the things. Jimmy, I was right <laughs> there! Jimmy! He knew where you had to go. He obviously knows about you because he was sitting outside that door waiting. Played you. Jimmy, you're a cunt. <laughs> Just. Fuck off, mate. <laughs> Might well, as well. Well, overshot it. What difference does it make at this point? Really, it doesn't make any difference. It's not like there's really any real punishment for, uh... Come on, 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 come on. HA! Screw you, Jimmy! Yeah! Yes! Progression! And this cutscene is just epic. It is every time. It is, like, reminds me of my childhood so much. I was always daydreaming about stuff like this. <sighs> Wanted to find my own princess and save her from an evil red-headed guy. Ironic how I'm playing as a red-headed guy now. <laughs> I'm and just gonna to dispel run. rumors, this is not a Ganon backstory. No, this is not a Ganon backstory. Although I wish people did games like that, because that would be really cool. Huh? But Nintendo would never. Oh, play. okay. I've read some um, fan art Ganon backstories. And uh, I actually really like some of them. Some of them, like, break my heart, though. I'm like, yeah. I'm like, oh, I feel bad for hating the guy. But he's a dick. Oh, 
Oh, there's a button. I pushed it. Hey! Oh, more guys. Fuck, I have Crooner. Yeah. I didn't actually know what Crooner meant until I looked it up. It's actually... Oh, crap. How do I explain this? The term for a male who sings in a soft, sultry voice. These guys are not crooners by any definition no. of the word. <laughs> no, crooner would be like, you know, Frank Sinatra. Yeah, well, not, not, not these guys. jazz singers would be crooners. So don't get me wrong, Juju was the one that started that, and it's just, you know, he starts something and it gets to be so catchy. No matter how inaccurate no, it may be. Yeah, and, and no matter how much you hate saying it at first, or hate hearing him say it over and over again, you just catch yourself doing it and you're like... Well, fudge. Don't let him shoot it. Oh, he got stuck. Do the hustle. He's obviously having some mechanical problems. Oh, yeah, it's just. You keep backing up and running away from me. I'm still gonna kick your ass. Whoa! He's yet to fire like a single I didn't arrow. know you could walk on air. That is awesome. Is that fluffy? Yeah, that's the cat. You can see my brother hugging a tree. I found you! <laughs> yes. Ha! Ah! You couldn't see it, but he's killed now. Yeah, see, there he is. He's hugging a tree. So now your life is being incorporated into this game within a game. And that guy's pointed like, haha, your arm fell off. Yeah, let's... Oh, I can slice it and it go away. That's always the first thing you try when you encounter yeah. a problem in life. You always punch Even it Even when it's a rock it. and you know it's not going to happen, you still slice it, just you like in Everland. You first, because, you know, you might be playing an RPG in your life, and it opens up a secret hallway. It happens all the time. Yeah, I love those memes where they're um, patchwork walls where they've been patched up and and it's like the caption is um, If Legend of Zelda taught me anything, it's that I need a bomb for this. Exactly. I'm like, you know, you could go to prison, but that's so a bomb epic. And a hook shot and you can solve all the world's problems. Right? You actually watch the theory on the hook shot that if Link were to use something like that, realistically it would just destroy him. It would break so many bones, rip his arm out of his socket. Yeah. I, I didn't know that. The force behind it to be able to pull him would just have to be and so And that monstrous. distance? Yeah, yeah. Someone actually did the math. Especially if in the Ocarina of Time when you get the extra long hook shot. Yeah. <coughs> and the chain would not be able to hold its shape and keep that kind of tension for that distance. Yeah, exactly. I don't understand how it would be a straight shot. The grappling hook in Wind Waker made more sense to me, and then he got, you know, a, a hook shot anyway, and I'm like, well... I don't know, just watching that video kind of just destroyed my perspective on but the hook again, shot. But then again, this is a world of magic and fairies and stuff, I mean, so. yeah, a lot of that stuff doesn't exist, per se, so... Oh, I got an achievement. I'm getting the hang of this. I am getting the hang of this. Oh, he's taking a little nap. Sneak attack. Hey, buddy. Oh, I guess not. Oh. Maybe that's one of my friends. We could use one of those. Do I have friends? I don't know if you have friends. Don't say anything, Ray. I know you're thinking it. Who wants to be friends with you, Rainbow? <laughs> I'm editing. I'm not even listening. <laughs> God damn. I'm listening to. Moonlight Sinatra over here trying to <laughs> <laughs> So you're hearing me and then me, right? Yes. Oh, man. That's why I'm not even listening to you. Denied. Oh, oh it looks school. like I am in the next chapter. But, you know, I, I don't know if I should keep going or just make this a really short episode. Because this is the next chapter and it's going to take me like another 30 plus minutes to yeah. solve this puzzle and... I do have some other videos to record because we got Windows 7 reinstalled the computer. Is he in high school or middle school? Does that look like high school or middle school to you? Oh. I, I see a graduation cap and some other, like, trophies and stuff. 
It could Pretty be sure lower high school. Freshman year, I think, maybe. Yeah, probably. I don't think a middle schooler has that many books. No, that's pretty monstrous. Yeah, okay, so, and the sun is setting, that's... And Jimmy's coming. I don't think I have Jimmy anymore. You know, whatever, whatever happens, whatever. We got Windows 7 installed, because apparently Windows 10 doesn't support some games, and some Steam games, and I don't like that. I liked Windows 10, but I don't like that it doesn't support some games, because... I don't want to be picky about what games we play for the channel just because of Windows 10. So we reinstalled 7. Everything works fine now. Not to mention, there were some problems with Windows 10 anyway. And I, I was the only one having problems. So if you still want to try Windows 10, I suggest it. But if you're a gamer, you may want to wait until they fix it. Because you don't have a ray to help you with these things. Yeah. If you make that mistake. Yeah, if you don't have an IT person in your house, you may want to wait a little bit. Exactly. So, yeah, I think I'm going to end the episode here. And we'll pick up fresh on this another time. Anyway, this is Robotastic and Fretless Arcade wishing you a very merry afternoon. Peace. Or morning. Or evening. Whatever you're doing Without in your breakfast. life. Without breakfast. Because you don't cut. You don't get to have <laughs> breakfast because Jimmy hates you. Check out some of the links in the description. Make sure you check out his channel, too. Follow us on all of our social media, Twitter, Facebook, and other stuff. I don't know what all we have. Because I am a terrible manager. We're working on a Patreon <laughs> account. Go check that out, too. Working on a what? Patreon. We're working on a Patreon account. Which, if you don't know what that is, that is crowdsource funding, where you send us money and we do... Whatever as a reward for you donating money to us. Which we wouldn't really be doing, but I'm usually the one that puts the money into the funding for this channel. And I, my bag is messed up, so I can't work as much as I could before. I can still make enough to pay my bills, but I don't make enough to support YouTube as well, so that's why we <laughs> have that set up. Because I'm dumb. And I did dumb things, and I hurt my back. Bang Check out the links in the dumb. description. Like, subscribe share, check out our social media, and as always, stay salty, my friends. Stay salty.